cocky, 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 and the narrow movement. Yeah, it is. We got the Wayne Bros, man. Season 2, episode 2. You feel me? About to see what it's here for, man. Run them likes up for it, brother, man. Comment down below what y'all thought of the reaction. Comment down below what y'all thought of the episode. And yeah. If y'all got anything that y'all want a brother to react to, man, you more than welcome to comment down below. If it comes to uh, music, TV shows, shit, you never know. A brother might, you know what I'm saying, actually, you know, do a movie reaction. You dig? If y'all really want to see it, man, comment down below. And when you press that subscribe button, man, you join that motherfucking Denaro movement. More than the motherfucking movement, some motherfucking lifestyle. Yaddy! Say, man, we're going to get right into this episode, man. I seen uh, Marlon Wayne's posted up on Instagram, if I'm not mistaken, saying that um, the Wayne, uh, Wayne Bros, the Wayne's, you know, family, you know what I mean, um, is going to be working on a new scary movie and returning to the scary movie franchise. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like, man, that's dope, man. That's big, man. Because at the end of the day, shit, scary movie one, scary movie two, and a little bit of scary movie three was was all fire. It was funny. You know what I mean? Straight, you know what I'm saying? Uh, bootleg classics. You know what I'm saying? In my, my eyes, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Because a brother like me caught it on the bootleg. You did. Shit. I ain't went to the motherfucking, uh, you know what I'm saying? Corner store. Buddy was selling the bootleg CDs back in the day. Shit. Brought them bitches off them. Y'all know, know how that shit be. You did. But, yeah. Excited for them, man. It's a long time coming, man. And, you know, scary the Scary Movie franchise fell off after the Wayne family. You know what I'm saying? Left the, uh... You know, from, you know, being part of the production and writing the scripts and shit like that. You know what I mean? I'm making the scary movies as it is. But I'm glad they returned to that. But we gonna get right into this episode of the Wayne Bros. Episode 2. I'm gonna quit yapping my motherfucking guns. We gonna get right into this motherfucking John. You did. Sean, are you still upset about Lisa? No. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, look, man, don't feel bad. Everybody gets dumped. Hey, I was not dumped. She said it wasn't working out. She said she didn't want to see me anymore. And she said she didn't want to speak to me again. And I said... Motherfucker, you okay. was dumped. <laughs> <laughs> you was dumped, thing. motherfucker. Look, Sean. <laughs> but I'm telling you, there's tons of girls that want to be with you. Tons. I mean, there's Bertha and Etta. <laughs> That's two tons right there. <laughs> Fun, I'm a man. Brothers got to roam, you know what I'm All saying? Right. Roam around. What's out there? What's out there? What I see? What I see? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You can't cage a jungle cat, baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Simba. Come on, let's go, Simba. Where to? We're going to take a safari down to the China Club. Oh, I can't go. Why not? Because That's where Lisa dumped me. <laughs> <laughs> Cosmo. Perhaps if you had familiarized yourself with it, you wouldn't have gotten dumped. <laughs> hey, I did not get dumped. Uh-huh. It was mutual. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm on Slim Fast. <laughs> and you come home, you were crying your eyes out. Remember what I told you? Never to share my jock strap with anyone? <laughs> you just remember this. Just because you get dropped from a team doesn't mean you have to change the sport. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're not thinking about changing the sport, are you? <laughs> you mean giving up baseball? Oh, no. Oh, hell no. <laughs> there you go. That girl make Lisa look like LaWanda Page. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what are you trying to say? I can't get her number? Basically, yeah. You gonna sleep on a kid like that? <laughs> This ought to wake you up. I got 20 bucks that says I can get her number. You got a deal, baby. 20, what's up? Make it happen, baby. 
Actually, I was just straightening up your magazine rack. Your ebony is mixed in with your people magazine. Oh, for a minute there, I thought you were the magazine police. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but I just really like things in their place. Mm -hmm. Well, your place or mine. <laughs> you, you know, Rachel, I've been thinking about getting a little something to nibble on. You mean lunch? That, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Would you like to join me? I'd love to. Let's go to Pops. I happen to know the owner. Denzel again. Yeah! <laughs> Why don't we go back to my place and I'll let you polish my Oscar? <laughs> or better yet, maybe I'll let you get undressed and spank me like they did in Glory. <laughs> <laughs> so crazy. <laughs> cuckoo, cuckoo. <laughs> I see where your son gets his charm and good looks. You know, if I wasn't old enough to be your daddy, I'd be your daddy. Uh, he said, I'd be your daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, I don't know, Pop got it though, he still got it. I'm fucking screaming. So you made things more better. Ah, I have to go. I have a two o'clock appointment. You have my card. You'll call me later? I sure will. Okay. Have a mighty fine day. <laughs> Ooh, boy, boy, boy. Help me, please. <laughs> I understand your new ladies keep you out late at night. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Pops, you know how it is. I sure do, you'll devil you. <laughs> Jump out the old block. Oh, she's freaky deep. She is oh, the old block. Pop, 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 pop. What about you? He says, he says right. she's freaky deaky, though. <laughs> and she said to tell you she thinks she's cute. Oh, well, I won't be late anymore. Bam! <laughs> oh, snap. A movado? Who did you rob? Nobody. I just happened to have a very generous girlfriend. That bro got you a Movado? So you sold me out for a stupid watch, huh? Sean, sweetheart. Remember, you're hanging with me tonight. Don't fall for that booby trap. Hey. <laughs> I got I got this relationship under control. Remember, they don't call me the player for nothing. Mm -hmm. They call me the player. <laughs> you left so early this morning, I forgot to tell you that we're gonna have a romantic picnic followed by a carriage ride through Central Park. Um, that sounds beautiful, baby, but mm -hmm. I already made plans with Mullen. I, I can't go. <laughs> that is so cute. But seriously, I'll pick you up around 8 o'clock. Uh -huh. <laughs> Rachel, I'm serious. I made plans with Mullen already. I'm gonna have to take a rain check. Oh, really? <laughs> Hold on, I'll walk you to your office. <laughs> that motherfucker wrapped around. The wrinkles are too good for the weave, queen. I like to look good, okay? And for your information, that's not a weave. She got Indian in her family. <laughs> You're just jealous because our kids are going to come out with that good hair. Hey, <laughs> Okimo Sabi. <laughs> Coming up in here and barging in without announcing yourself? I don't need permission to come into my man's house. Where's the mustard? Hey, damn the mustard, Gina. Uh, damn the mustard, all right? Somewhere. <laughs> oh. Listen, let's get something straight, all right? I'm a third degree black belt, a kickboxing champ. I could really hurt you. Oh, look at you. Anyone who comes between me and my man will feel the wrath of Rachel. <laughs> Damn, you good. Put it on your sandwich is just the way you like it. Oh, thank you, baby. You know me so well. You must have ESPN. Huh? <laughs> All right, Mom. Yeah, peace. Check the spot. Don't wait up. Son, I'm telling you, this girl's one can short of a six pack. Mom, for the last time, back off, okay? Rachel's the sweetest girl I ever met. All right. Michael Douglas thought Glenn Close was sweet until she frickin' see this rabbit. <laughs> Look, if you don't have nothing nice to say about Rachel, just don't say anything at all. Hey, guys, come on in. I ain't got nothing to say. <laughs> Wipe your feet. <laughs> what are you doing here? I'm cooking you dinner. No, 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 let me rephrase that. What are you doing in my house? Haven't you heard breaking an entry is against the law? 
Yes. And that's why I had this key made. She had... I'm sorry, honey. I spent too much time searching for the perfect man. And now that I found him, I'm not about to let you go. Uh-huh. This is crazy, isn't it? That's why I had this made. Sean and Rachel. Yo, man, you are right. That girl is Tales from the Dark Side. That's what I've been trying to tell you. Welcome back from Bonerville. <laughs> so what are we supposed to do now? Well, first, we have to change for dinner. Mm-hmm. Yo, Molly! Come in! All right, hold on. Let me just finish this last two. Mm. Mm. Oh, calm down. It's only corn. Yeah. Mm. You want some? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Behavior acceptable. Mm. Calm down. Look at the chains on the back. Look at that. Fabulous one. Shut the. You call that a belt? <laughs> Sean, please. Is that a challenge? Oh boy, I got twenty dollars. Oh, I got 40. I got 60 plus my watch. The Movado I gave you? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bravo. Thank you. Bravo. Thank you. Don't be rude, Thank you. girl. Clap. Thank you. I'll be your <laughs> he own. said, don't be rude, Thank girl. You. Clap. Don't you dare. That watch is a symbol of our love, and you're going to throw it away on a belch? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy I found out about you. I am out of here and I am never coming back, ever. Well, I'll send for my things. Well, here, before you go, take some food with you. Mm. Oh, hey, please. Rachel, please, wait. I want you to give you the keys to my brand new Lexus. Oh, oh <laughs> Yes, baby. Oh, yes. Rachel, wait, wait, please, Rachel, don't go. I'll do Denzel as many times as you want. Architectural Digest. Uh, for you? Yes, we do. Let me check. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I have a copy right over here. Hey! Look up, Marlon. Say cheese. Oh, that was the way, bros, man. These motherfuckers is stupid. They silly as hell. Silly as shit, man. Silly as shit. For real. For real, for real. Like, yo. Chick Fancy. I forgot the, the actress' real name, but, you know, she played Fancy on the Jamie Foxx show. With the, she flipped the script as Rachel, you know, guest star in the Wayne Bros. Yo. Yo. Man, man, she she was on some bullshit. She was on some bullshit. But yeah, funny episode though. Funny episode. Run them lights up though for a brother, man. Comment down below. What y'all thought of the reaction? What y'all thought of the episode, man? If y'all made it this far of this video, man, you know what I'm saying? Hey, smash that motherfucking subscribe button for a brother, man. When you smash that subscribe button, man, you join that motherfucking De Niro movement more than a motherfucking movement. It's a motherfucking lifestyle, you dig? I'm gonna catch y'all on the flip side, man. Y'all be smooth how y'all be smooth. Peace.